Our top five looks at some more tennis players to have appeared on our show as teenagers. First up is Tommy Haas. It was 1991 when we travelled to Germany to meet up with him when he was 13. Back then, he was being hailed as the next Boris Becker. Haas is currently recovering from a shoulder injury and has amassed over $12 million in prize money, but is yet to win a major. In 2006, we were in Australia to profile Bernard Tomic. The 14-year-old was being compared to Leighton Hewitt, and in the years that have followed, he certainly displayed a similar fiery temperament. Tomic just needs to start adding more ATP titles to his name. Ten years ago, we went to France to find out more about a 19-year-old Gael Monfils. Many were predicting that he would become the first black man to win a major since his compatriot Yannick Noah in 1983. So far, Monfils' best performance at a Grand Slam has been reaching the semis at Roland Garros. In 2003, we journeyed to the Spanish island of Mallorca to meet Rafael Nadal. Rafa was just 16 at the time, but already showing the skills that would make him the greatest clay court player of all time. To date, Rafa has won 14 majors, the same number as Pete Sampras. And finally, in 2001, Transworld Sport headed to the Swiss city of Basel to meet Roger Federer. He was 19 back then, and yet to win any of his record-breaking 17 Grand Slam singles titles. Federer has gone on to top the world rankings for an open era record of 302 weeks. Subscribe now to our YouTube channel for the very best of Transworld Sports.